Hello there, dear friends, and welcome to the introduction to a brand new series, which we will be starting very, very soon. As you can see, we have kind of already started it, uh, as you can kind of tell from my uh, little wardrobe here. But if you don't know what this game is, well, then how about I tell you right now, dear friend? Dear friend, this game is called Ark Survival Evolved, and well, I personally love it to death. I mean, just look at this cute little otter right here. This thing is adorable. I'll tell you that. This thing, it is the purest thing in the freaking world. And there's, you know, penguins and, you know, fluffy tyrannosaurs, you know. If you kind of like dinosaurs, like I do, then I think you will really enjoy this little series. This series will be from the basis of Ark Survival Evolved, the entire story of it, you know? The entire story. From my perspective. Let's, let's get HUD back on. Yeah, there we go. It might not be too clean, but, you know, we're, we just need to do that for just a second. If you like dinosaurs, and, and exotic dinosaurs like this one, a robot. Who doesn't like robots? Like, come on. Robots are super cool. Right? Yeah, robots are definitely cool enough for you. I hope the robots are cool enough for you. Because I think they should be cool enough for everyone at this point. At this point in life. Oh. And there's, you know, tiny little baby sheep. But... That's not here or there, you know? But this story will be from me entering the Ark and my perspective of dealing with life on the Ark. Similar to how characters like Helena Walker, Ro Edmund Rockwell, N uh, Nerva Gaius, or Gaius Nerva, whatever his Greek name is, and me and, you know, everyone, and how they wrote their stuff down in, like, Explorer Notes and all that, and how there's an entire story throughout the entire Ark and all that. So... That's what this series will essentially be for me. It'll be my perspective of going through the arc and the entire story from my perspective. Will there be some some weird things? Yes, there will be, obviously. It's a series. Everything will be unique and custom to me. But I won't be using any of my already known knowledge. We'll have to figure everything out ourselves. But obviously, I'm not going to make 100 episodes about how do I make a treehouse? Hint, I just did that, by the way. Anyways, we will just be continuing going through the story of Ark by ourselves. Most probably by ourselves. You know, just just us and our little otter friend. But we won't be using any cheats, obviously. Their difficulty will be vanilla eventually. We won't start out the completely default normal server settings. We'll start out with some stuff to get us going faster. And eventually it'll return to normal. In fact, where I currently am in the series, it's already, a lot of it has already been pre-recorded, by the way. And currently where I am, the settings are almost completely server setting-wise. So, you don't need to worry about me finding a level 5,000 Tyrannosaur. Like, this Tyrannosaur found in... I think it was actually bread. Uh, yeah, it, it was bread... So, we're, we're not going to be finding any stupid high-level dinosaurs. But, oh man, we will be doing some crazy stuff in this series. Let me tell you that. We're going to solo everything. We're going to make some beautiful structures and tons of bases. Hey, did you, did you hear that? We're going to make some bases. Do you want to see some of the amazing bases that we're going to be experiencing in this series? I'll, I'll show you some right now. Set bases. Do you like? Well, first of all, tons of cool looking robot dinosaurs? I know, I sure do. Do you like little greenhouses? Do you want to see an even bigger greenhouse? I know, I sure do. Do you like peaceful little scene, scenaric, you know, full, full of dynamic scenery? For breeding baby dinosaurs? Oh, yes, that is right. Baby dinosaurs, baby robot dinosaurs, the entire shebang. I mean, just look at some of these bad boys and girls. In fact, those three girls, this is, this is the one lucky dude. And we got some weird cousins in the back. But we don't talk about the weird cousins. Look at them, they're ready for a war. Oh, did I mention that we're gonna be fighting ginormous creatures? Huge, godly, diverse, unique creatures. Oh, there's so many things that wants to come and rip all of our flesh apart. But 
You won't see that right now. You'll have to tune into the series to see that kind of death and, well, sadness. Speaking of emotions, we will be going through tons of them in the series. Happiness, sadness, oh, absolute pure anger among almost all other emotions. There is an emotion that starts with an H I hope I do not experience on the island of just dinosaurs. That'd be a little concerning, wouldn't you think so? Now, don't you want to see the biggest greenhouse in the entire world? I think I do. I think I would too. Introducing the world's biggest greenhouse. I think it's not uh, compensating for anything. It's a ginormous greenhouse. Who doesn't want a giant greenhouse? Actually, I know one thing I'd want more. A giant frickin' wall. Don't you want a giant frickin' wall? I know, I sure want a giant frickin' wall. That might be a little wobbly. But a giant frickin' wall nonetheless. Look at this. Giant wall. Giant real estate property. Oh, did you want more dinosaurs? Oh, because we have them all here at Camp... Um... Dinosaur. Yes, Camp Dinosaur. Or, you know, Camp Arkea, but yeah, it doesn't really matter too much, because we got a, a nice fruity pebbly man. A nice beautiful dinosaur. We got some pointy boys. We got some techie boys. We got some murder chickens, some tickle tickle chickens. And we got, you know, the entire shebang here. Ah, a better question is what don't we have? Oh, a dragon. Oh, but there might be a dragon somewhere, who knows? You'll just have to tune into the series and, uh, find out, won't you, dear friends? Because that is going to be a surprise left for... That's right, the series. But I can assure you, there is something really big that flies, that breathes fire, that will be trying to kill us. So, if you like that kind of thing, I would highly recommend you, uh... Stick around for a bit, if you like monkeys, too. I would also recommend you stick around. Among other amazing boss fights, I highly encourage you to stick around. Now then, if you would be so kind as to tune in, mm, possibly tomorrow, for the first episode, that would greatly uh, make my heart very happy, to be honest. And... I'm sure you would enjoy it, too, seeing the start of a brand new, beautiful, beautiful island. And, well, just tons of new gameplay for everyone to enjoy. Everyone in the family can enjoy this. Now, please, go about to enjoy your day, and please come back tomorrow to see something absolutely incredible. Thank you, and see you then.